Hi, in this video I'm gonna show you how to make a cylinder whether it's a solid cylinder or a surface cylinder out of the circle that we made in the previous tutorial. So as you can see I'm starting here from my previous file and the only one command that we're gonna use here is extrude. So just type in extrude in the search bar and from here you're gonna see two types of uh, commands which is here uh, extrude as a solid So this guy, which is here, a curve extrude as a solid. I know there is another method that's in the direction. I'm just gonna ignore that for now. And here, extrude, just extrude. That's mean it's gonna do it as a surface. So when you see there is no solid word, that's mean. Sorry, if you see the solid word, that's mean it's a solid extrusion. If you doesn't see the, <clears throat> if you didn't see the extrude solid, that's mean it's a surface. So let's connect those wires. So it's need a curve and a distance. There's a default distance of a value of one and both. So no worry about it right now. So just uh, connect that to the surface. Here, the circle to the curve. And you can see now we have it as a surface. Then I can take that, paste it, change the height of it. Sorry, change the name of it into height and again connect that to the distance and now you can change the height and that's the beginning of a make, making a parametric uh, parametric cylinder now let's try let's deconnect or disconnect so I'm gonna connect it to the distance here and this guy I'm gonna connect it to this and now we're gonna make a solid a solid one as you can see you see so that's that's the way it is and that's how we make a, a parametric cylinder whether it's a solid or surface by depending on curve extrude and remember the important thing if it doesn't say solid that means it's a surface and you can add another uh, slider here to control the height and even if you don't then you're gonna get the default value of one Thank you very much for watching and have a good day.